I landed again in the Netherlands and after a busy tour in the UK, I now have many programs lined up here. I have a big Art of Breathing program that I'll be conducting in Amsterdam, as well as a tour through the Netherlands, teaching an interesting new workshop about mantras and meditation. And in between, I have some TV uh, shoots for some TV programs. They have invited me to be part of their programs. I have some radio interviews and many more things. So let us see what this week will bring. I'm right now in the middle of Amsterdam and I was requested for an interview for a TV program. This is some of the crew. They're just figuring out where exactly they want to position us for the shoot here. It's around meditation. Right now I'm sitting in the studio of one of the radio stations in the Netherlands and we just had a small interview here. Um, as you can see, we have wonderful people here. Let me give you one tour. It was a wonderful interview. So after starting the tour in the Netherlands, visiting many different cities and conducting a program on mantras and meditation, next week we will continue. I will visit another six, seven cities in the Netherlands. And also I'll be traveling to London, to the UK again, for a big Guru Purnima celebration there. And in the meantime, in the Netherlands also, we will have a, an event where we will launch my book. Of course, it has been launched uh, two months ago already in the Netherlands but this was still pending. So we have an event around the book and also um, it coincides with the second edition of the book coming because the first edition is already sold out. So that is another celebration. And it has been beautiful to see how people across the Netherlands, who many of whom are totally new to some of the concepts that I've been sharing, were so enthusiastic about the ancient Vedic knowledge of astrology, of Jyotish, of Ayurveda, of mantras, and how it practically relates to our life, how all of these things are connected and how by paying some attention on how to manage these five elements that everything is made up of can have such uh, practical benefits for our day-to-day -day activities, for our health, our well-being, our success, and also our happiness and peace. So I look forward to seeing you again next week and do join me again as the journey continues. Mm -hmm.